Hey guys, welcome to our YouTube channel. Today we are going to solve our skill track daily challenge using Python programming language. Before going to logic, if you didn't subscribe to our channel, then subscribe right now and make our work more meaningful. First, we'll understand our question. The program has to accept the string yes as the input, then reverse the first half and second half of the string yes, and then the program must reverse the first half and second half. of the first half and reverse the first half and second half of the second half of yes. So the program must accept the string yes and reverse the first half and second half of the string yes. Then reverse the first half and second half of the first half of yes. Then reverse the first half and second half of second half of yes. So finally, we must print the modified string. And we have also given a note that if the length of if the length is odd, then the reverse other part except the middle character so we'll take our first test case so here we'll split into the first half and second half now we'll reverse each half so when the first half is reversed we'll get u g r u then we'll reverse the second half Then after that, we'll have first half and second half in the first half. So we'll split them like this. So now we will reverse. So this becomes GU and here it is UR. Sorry, here we'll have uh, RA. So here we'll have AR. Then here we'll have NT and this will be reverse. We'll have ME. Now we'll concatenate them and print as our output. So this will be our output of the program. Now we'll take our second test case. So here you can see that the length is odd so we'll have the middle character so first half will be reversed the middle character remains same and the second half will be reversed so further we'll split them and then we'll reverse the halves so here it is sk and here it is cl here it is kc and r and now we'll concatenate them and print it as our output. So this should be our output of the program. Now let us implement our program. First we'll get the string yes. So we'll convert it to the list so that it will be easy to perform our operations. Then after that we'll have L equal to the length of yes double slash two that is we'll have the first half and the second half. And 
so now we have to apply our condition that is if the length of es mod 2 equal to equal to 1 means that is if it is odd then es equal to reverse of es plus list of that is will have the middle character unreversed that is it remains the same right so for that we'll have the middle character in list of ps of l then we'll have the second half to be reversed so l plus one now the second half is reversed and the first half is reversed so else that is if it is even means we have to just reverse the first half and we have to reverse the second half and at last yes is equal to the reverse of yes that is we'll have the split ups in the first half itself and finally we'll concatenate them and print yes so now we'll have the function reverse so the reverse of list if the list mod 2 equal to equal to 1 means that is if it is odd then the mid is equal to the length of list double slash 2 and list equal to list of mid and it is reversed so the first half is reversed and then we'll have the middle character and then we'll reverse the second half so else that is if it is even we'll just reverse the first half and the second half and here it is mid equal to len of list in len of list double slash two and finally we'll return the list so here it is len of list so let us execute our program with our first test case. So here we have got the correct output. Then we'll have our second test case. Here also we have got the correct output. Our program has passed all our given test cases successfully. Hope you guys understand. Thanks for watching. See you next video.